What is up my butter biscuits? In today's video, I'm gonna be going over the holiday gift sets from Sephora that I would actually purchase. I do wanna say this before jumping into the video. There are some products on here or some gift sets in this list that I wouldn't purchase for myself, but I would purchase for my friend because I do kind of feel this is a little bit of a gift guide of things that I think are worth the value or things that I think make good gifts, but not necessarily that I would use myself. And obviously I'll go over which ones I'm talking about within today's video. Also too, before jumping into this, make sure you guys let me know down below in this video if there's anything that I missed, maybe something that I should try because I did put a couple products on the list that I do really want to try out if they go on sale after Christmas. I know a lot of you guys are probably thinking, okay, I'm a little bit too late for this video. But if you guys have not seen in my previous videos, I kind of like waiting to do my shopping anyway. So I'm like, you know what? Let me make my holiday gift set a little bit later in the month. Because if you guys have not seen, sometimes usually with Sephora, the day after Christmas, holiday gift sets will go on sale to be a little bit cheaper. I did see in the beginning of this month, they did offer a 20% off of holiday gift sets and I did pick up one Charlotte Tilbury Hollywood flawless setting spray or whatever it's called um but I low-key was kind of like damn last year I paid $20 for it this year I paid $28 and I did save a couple bucks but I just you know I want to save a little bit more anyways today's video is kind of like my wish list my buy guide of what I would purchase from holiday gift sets um and yeah make sure you guys let me know what you guys plan on purchasing too or maybe there's something that I should try within this video because I will be looking for deals after Christmas so make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up I would really appreciate that let's go ahead and get into it I forgot to mention in the beginning of this video too if you guys are interested in this makeup look that I created I did a review of the Scorpio palette so it'll be linked somewhere on this video or back on my channel if you guys are curious about this look right here because I know it's so rare for me to wear makeup these days anyways let's go ahead and get into this by the way too there are some things in here that I would like to try that I haven't tried before so if you guys have any opinions about the product please let me know down below because honestly y'all you guys give some good recommendations and opinions so I kind of do want to know your guys' opinion about some things that I haven't tried for example this very first set right here I I've been really wanting to try these moisture glows. These are um, plumping lip serum duos from Makeup by Mario. I swatched a couple of these in store, the full size ones, and I'm like, y'all. They look really, really beautiful. I swatched it on my hand. I didn't try it on my lips, so I don't know how the plumping effect is because as you guys know, I don't really like that like lip injections type of feel. You know what's really crazy? I went through a phase like maybe... I want to say maybe about six years ago, maybe five years ago, where I was like obsessed with that because y'all, I really like the extreme lip injections from Too Faced. And then I don't know what happened with my lips or just happened with me that I'm like, oh, I don't like that like overly plumping feeling. Do you know what I mean? I like a very mild plumping feeling. It's really weird. So anyways, this right here is a set from uh, Makeup by Mario and they do have multiple different colors. This retails for $24 but they are mini, and I really do wanna try these. Honestly, I don't know how much of a savings this is right here, being that they are mini, and to my understanding, they don't sell mini, they just sell full, so I can't tell you guys how much you're saving right here, but I do think this is a good time to try, because they're pretty much only $12 each, but low-key, y'all know that I am waiting to see if they do go on sale after Christmas, so this is the first thing on my wish list that I have not tried yet. As you guys know, every single year, I have to put this on my list, because I am obsessed with Charlotte Tilbury um, Flawless oh my gosh airbrush flawless setting spray I absolutely love these right here this is actually something that I already picked up when they did have the 20% off this retails for $32 and it does say that it is a $46 value so it is a pretty decent savings right there I have to say this is just one of those setting sprays that I actually do notice a difference on. There is a lot of long wearing setting sprays out there that claim to be like, oh my gosh, it's going to keep your makeup on for 16 hours. This doesn't have any like crazy claims like this, well, at least like on the bottle and stuff like that. But I do have to say, I notice that at the end of the day, if I have my makeup on for like eight to 10 hours, my makeup's still looking good with this. And I really do like it. But I have to say, in my opinion, it's just so expensive. Like it's really expensive. She came out with like a six ounce bottle and it's like $51. And I'm like, damn y'all her stuff is really really pricey so any single time that they do have the holiday gift set i do take advantage of the 20 percent off and get these i absolutely love this setting spray i don't know how you guys feel about it but in my personal opinion it works on my skin and helps keep my makeup on all day long but also on top of that too what i really love about it is that it like doesn't make your skin look overly matte do you know what i mean like say for example if you have on a dewy foundation or a dewy powder or like satin powder i should say it keeps maintaining that satin look throughout the day it doesn't make you look matte so i highly recommend this setting spray 
Next up on the list, we have Glow Recipe. This is the Plum Hydration Heroes Kit, and it does come with the um, Glow Recipe Plum Plump Hyaluronic Cream, which, by the way, my skin loves this moisturizer, but it's really weird, though, that, like, say, for example, if I'm wearing too much hyaluronic acid, my skin gets a little bit bally. and you know what's weird, too, is recently I've been wearing um, the Sweetener Foundation that has hyaluronic acid in it, and if I wear this moisturizer right here, they just do not go good together, kind of, like, balls up, but my skin loves this moisturizer when it's, like, bare. If I'm not putting anything on it, my skin loves this. And then it does come with the um, new lip gloss balm that is also part of the Plum Hydration line. So this retails for $40. Well, actually, right now I should say it's on sale for $40 because the actual retail sticker on it is $44. It's just currently on sale for $40. So I do think that is a good deal because it does say that it is a $61 value. And while we're talking about Glow Recipe, honestly, y'all, I saw all these comments on Trend Mood that everyone was like talking trash that they're like, okay, eventually they're going to run out of fruits. But I do have to say pretty much every single glow recipe product i've used i've really liked so i don't know what that is about but i don't know i like it this right here is the fruit babies best sellers kit so it does come with a variety of products for 38 dollars once again these are like minis of like things that i don't think they sell like all of these in minis to my understanding so it doesn't have an actual value on it but it does say 38 dollars Something like this, I think, is a really good gift idea for somebody who is just trying to get into skincare. I feel like Glow Recipes products are really easy to use, really user-friendly. They're not very difficult, do you know what I mean? And they're not, like, overwhelming. So I think this is a really good gift set. And it's actually something that I personally would like to try. Um, The next one right here is something that I would buy for a friend because my friend is obsessed with the Belief Moisturizer. She really, really likes it. I have never tried it, but I keep on telling myself that I'm going to try it. This set right here, I feel like, is a really good deal because it's on sale right now for $38. You know what's so funny is that it says the original price is $40 and it's on sale for $38. So it's only $2 off. But hey, I'll tell you what, this day and age, I'll take anything that I can get. But it does say that it is a $56 value. So it does come with the moisturizer. It comes with a jelly cleanser. It comes with the um, hydrating toner and then a moisturizing eye balm. So I feel like this is a really good set because it does also come with the full size belief moisturizer. Honestly, y'all, maybe I should try this moisturizer if I didn't just... You know what's so crazy? My skin has been so obsessed with that um, Vanny cream. It's like over-the-counter, like regular... Why did I say over-the-counter? It's like at CVS. Drugstore is what I meant to say, not over-the-counter. Moisturizer, and it's only $14, and my skin has been loving it. So if I didn't just buy a new one of that, maybe I would try this out because that does seem like a really good deal. Also, y'all, oh my gosh, everyone and their mom is obsessed with these right now. These are the Tarte... Um, I don't know how to pronounce it, so... Don't come at me if I pronounce this wrong. I don't know if it's maracuja or Mar Mar maracuja. I don't know. Juicy Lip Balm bestseller set right here. And you get two of them for $24. And that is a $48 value. So it's basically buy one, get one free. And honestly, y'all, my friends have these and they're obsessed with them. So I kind of do think I want to pick up one of these. Because y'all know I like a little tint of color on my lips. My only thing is like, say, for example, I'm wearing this gloss right now. And I'm just kind of like over it. So I wonder if it's like sticky feeling on the lips because the gloss that I'm wearing is just, it's a little bit thick. It's from Juvia's Place. And I'm like, ooh, like it looks really, really nice. I think it's super beautiful, but I don't know. Just in the corner of my lips, it just like gets a little chunky. So I'm curious to know how these are. Recently, I just saw that they came out with shimmer ones too. And I'm like, damn, those shimmer ones look absolutely amazing. But then I'm like, they look so shimmery that it looks like it'll be like, like gritty filling. Do you know what I mean? So I'm curious to know about those. Um, next up on the list, we have from Tatcha. This is the Clarifying Plus Pore Refining Essentials for Oily Skin. This right here, I pretty much always pick up every single year for either my mom, for my sister, or for one of my friends. They all love these sets right here, and I do think that these are a great value. This is actually currently on sale right now for $69.60 when it says the original price is $87, and the value is $120. So if you guys see this right now, this is a really really good deal because it does come with the deep cleanse which y'all know i love the deep cleanse but i don't recommend it if you guys have dry skin it definitely does leave your skin feeling a little bit dry and tight sometimes i like that feeling though depending upon how my skin is and then it does come with the water cream and the texture tonic honestly y'all this is a really really good deal especially that it's on sale right now for 69.60 because i want to say the moisturizer alone is 50 dollars. so 
that's a pretty good deal. Next up is a product that I want to try. I have heard really good things about Laneige. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. This set right here is the Water Bank Blue Hydration Hero Set with Hyaluronic Acid. And this is $32 and it does say that it is a $50 value. And then it comes with the Water Bank Blue Hyaluronic Serum. So this is something that I was really curious about trying. I actually almost pulled the trigger and bought this when I was um, buying a refill of my MAC. Um, oh my gosh, why do I always forget the name of my MAC moisturizer that I love so much? It's called like Skin Canvas Balm, something like that. I was like, oh, this feels really, really nice because I did put some on the back of my hand and I was like, oh, this feels nice. But then I was like, damn, my skin is obsessed with that MAC Skin Canvas Balm. Like, y'all, I don't even know why for some reason it helps tone down my redness like big time. I really, really like it. Um, but this right here is a really good deal. That's why I'm like, damn. During the holiday times, it's like, oh, y'all, I really try my hardest to not buy for myself. But then at the same time too, there's so many things that I want to try and things that are actually like on sale. So I do get tempted and I feel like $32 is not bad. So if you guys have tried this, please let me know. Okay. This next set right here is like low key controversial because so many people online absolutely hate it, but this is the Mario Badesco facial spray trio. And this is $21 for three, four ounce bottles. And a lot of people online do not like this. They say that there's no active ingredients in this. They say that it does absolutely nothing for your skin. But I have to say as somebody who does wear powder foundation on a daily basis, I really like spraying this on before and after because I feel like it does like kind of like liven up my skin and on top of that too I don't know what it is inside this that when I spray it on my skin before putting on my powder foundation It helps my powder foundation like cling to my skin and I think it looks really nice and to be real with you guys It's really really cheap like just think about it You get 12 ounces of product right here for $21 a lot of people will argue and say well You get 12 ounces of product right there and it's so cheap because it's pretty much just water I don't know but honestly y'all just keeping it with you guys I'll spray that on before putting on my powder foundation and my skin likes it. I feel like it looks good. And the last product on the list is actually something that I wouldn't buy for myself, but I think makes for great stocking stuffers if you have multiple kids or if you have like me, a lot of cousins, you like to like buy something for everybody that's not going to break the bank because this right here comes with three different eyeshadow sets. This is the Too Faced Let It Snow Globes Makeup Collection and it does come with three eyeshadow palettes for $27. It says that it's a $306 value. Y'all know that every single time I say about Too Faced, I feel Feel like they hype up the value just to make it seem like oh my god it's the most amazing deal ever and i'm like there's no way in hell that this is a 306 dollars value but i do want to say nonetheless these little eyeshadow palettes right here come with a little blush at the bottom and i think that it's a really cute gift for super cheap like just picture you get three of them for 27 dollars. and like me i have so many cousins y'all that i can't afford to buy full gifts for everybody but like little sets like this i'll break them apart and then just give them to them do you know what i mean put it in a cute little bag or put a little bow on it and call it a day and i feel like it's just thoughtful and it's really cheap at the end of the day i probably wouldn't buy it for myself though because y'all know how i feel about two face eyeshadows i just feel like they're you know kind of lackluster but honestly y'all the color stories are not bad in here it's just obviously when it comes down to all these colors i have everything like it and i do feel like they're cute little gifts in my personal opinion anyways that is it for this video make sure you guys let me know your thoughts and opinions about everything and honestly y'all i'm keeping it real with you guys i probably will be doing another video after christmas if there's a whole bunch of things that do go on sale so keep an eye out for that as well make sure you guys let me know too if there's any holiday sets that i should pick up because i'm gonna keep my eye out if so so make sure you guys let me know and i'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, Girl Scout.